uh, the Genomic Medicine Working Group's uh, GM8. Uh, those of you who are interested in GMs 1 through 7, uh, there's plenty of information on the web, um, and GM8 is, is uh, now starting. And the point uh, of all these have been trying to identify uh, where progress is being made, where there are gaps, uh, trying to um, make certain things happen. Like ha we're working with payers, we've worked with a lot of other groups at past meetings uh, to try to really stimulate things to happen in the field. And with this particular uh, working group, uh, we, we were focusing on the, the NIH portfolio, in particular the NHGRI portfolio, but also uh, looking across the different ICs and uh, identifying where uh, work is happening, but, but also where there are gaps that need to be filled. And re as, uh, as Terry will show, uh, past meetings have resulted in not only nice white papers that were published, uh, but, but also uh, RFAs for the uh, extramural community, uh, intramural opportunities across ICs and, and such. So the, the goal is not to have lost two days in Bethesda, uh, but, but rather to uh, produce uh, something that would really go forward. And, and certainly NHGRI has a, has a history of using these gatherings for, for real planning and real implementation. So I think from that standpoint, it's, it's going to be quite useful. We have a lot of representation from uh, across the, the United States, across North America, and in a few cases across the world. Uh, and, and so one of the things I'll do to, we can do to start um, is go around and introduce ourselves. Uh, there, there will be other opportunities to, uh, to get to know each other as well uh, throughout the day. Uh, but I'm Howard McLeod from Moffitt Cancer Center in Tampa, Florida. And I, it's freezing up here. I've never been this cold since I moved down there. Um, but other than that, um, it, it's, uh, I'm looking forward to the day. And maybe we can, we can start, uh, who's down at the end? Steve, is that you down at the end? We'll start down at the end since you were getting ready to take a bite. Uh, we'll go ahead and start with you. <laughs> You, you did that on purpose. Uh, I, I'm uh, Steve Jaffe. I'm in the Department of Medical Ethics and Health Policy at Penn. I'm also a pediatric oncologist, and I'm involved with one of the CSER projects, the Dana-Farber project. Janet Williams. I'm a genetic counselor at Geisinger. I'm in the genomic medicine department, work on the eMERGE uh, projects as well as a PCORI-funded project. I'm Julie Johnson from University of Florida, and PI of one of the IGNITE-funded projects. I'm Wendy Rubenstein, medical geneticist at NCBI. I uh, work on um, genetic testing registry, GTR. I uh, work on ClinVar and MedGen, and I'm also involved in the ISCC, uh, one of the reasons I'm here. I'm Stephen Kingsmore from Children's Mercy, Kansas City, and I'm the PI of one of the INSIGHT grants. Cynthia Powell, I'm a clinical geneticist and pediatrician and co-PI of one of the NSITE grants, um, the one at the University of North Carolina. I'm Bob Freemuth from Mayo Clinic. I do medical informatics looking at the pharmacogenomics of uh, clinical decision support. Uh, I'm involved with the PGRN and the eMERGE projects. I'm Mike Gaziano, I'm a VA Boston, Brigham Women's Hospital, Harvard Med School, and I'm PI of the Million Veteran Program. I'm Dan Roden from Vanderbilt. Uh, I'm, uh, I work uh, on uh, eMERGE, on the pharmacogenetics research network, and, uh, and I uh, am on NHGRI advisory council right now. And I, and, I, and I think no one has yet managed to introduce themselves without using at least three acronyms. Uh, Jeff Ginsberg from Duke University. I'm PI of one of the IGNITE. <laughs> projects, and also a member of the GMWG for <laughs> NHGRI. Uh, I'm Mary Relling at St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. I'm um, the incoming chair of the Pharmacogenomics Research Network, and I'm the leader of uh, CPIC for implementation of pharmacogenomics, and I'm also part of the GMWG. Mark Williams, I'm the director of the Genomic Medicine Institute at uh, Geisinger, a uh, member of the Genomic Medicine Working Group um, and chairing uh, panel four. And Howard, you've met. I'm Terry Manolio. I lead the Division of Genomic Medicine here at the Genome Institute. Rex Chisholm, Northwestern University in Chicago, uh, PI of one of the eMERGE uh, sites and also a member of the GMWG. I'm Carol Bolt, um, professor and deputy director of the Cancer Center at the Jackson Laboratory, Bar Harbor, Maine. I'm on NHGRI Council and a member of the working group. 
Eric Green, Director of NHGRI. I'll have a few more things to say as soon as we finish going around the room introducing ourselves. Howard Jacob, currently at the Medical College of Wisconsin for four weeks, uh, and then I'll be at Hudson Alpha in Huntsville, Alabama, and I think this is hot, Howard. I think I'm in trouble. Um, I am uh, a member of the working group uh, and also an NHGRI council. Chris Shute, Johns Hopkins, PI of one of the eMERGE grants and also on the External Scientific Advisory Committee of IGNITE. Um, Alexa McRae, uh, Harvard Medical School and one of the PIs of the Undiagnosed Diseases Network. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, Warwick Anderson, until recently head of the Australian National Health and Medical Research Council and shortly uh, of the Human Frontier Science Program. Good morning, Ruth Brenner. Uh, Chief of the Air Force Medical Service Personalized Medicine Program. Uh, Sharon Plon, Baylor College of Medicine. I'm one of the PIs of one of the clinical sequencing exploratory research or CSER sites, and I'm one of the ClinGen PIs. Robert Green, Brigham and Women's Hospital. I'm primarily involved with CSER and Insight and have small roles on some of the other acronyms. Katrina Goddard at Kaiser Permanente Northwest in Portland, Oregon. Um, I'm a PI on one of the CSER sites, and I chair the actionability work group for the ClinGen project. Gail Jarvik, head of medical genetics at the University of Washington. I'm a PI on um, eMERGE and CSER and have a supporting role for the Center for Mendelian Genetics. Heidi Rehm from Harvard Medical School. I'm a PI on the ClinGen project and also involved in CSER and Ensite. Uh, Jonathan Berg, I'm a clinical geneticist at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. Um, one of the co-PIs on a CSER project at UNC, Insight Project, and um, ClinGen. Uh, good morning, Pierre Moulin from Genome Canada. Uh, we uh, run uh, a relatively large uh, program, Genomics and Personalized Health, in uh, Canada. Uh, I'd like to thank the organizers for including Canada in your uh, deliberations. Thank you. Um, and uh, hope uh, uh, we have a very constructive day. Thank you. Good morning. Gurbani Trandhava from Agency for Healthcare Research and Quality uh, from Rockville. Um, Ellie, I know you've been here for 24 hours or whatever in NHGRI, but could you start off this row? I'm Ellie Silverman, and I'm a program analyst at NHGRI. I'm Jackie Ogis. I'm program analyst for the Genomic Medicine Working Group. Heidi Sophia, program director, NHGRI. Louise Witteroff, and I'm a program director on detail to NHGRI. Aaron Ramos, Division of Genomic Medicine. I'm the program director for ClinGen and Phoenix. Barb Conley, I'm a medical oncologist, uh, currently uh, uh, associate director of cancer diagnosis program, and here on behalf of the Division of Cancer Treatment and Diagnosis for a couple of NCI genomically uh, with trials with genomic eligibility. Jeff Strewing from the Division of Genomic Medicine and NHGRI. Annie Niehaus, Division of Genomic Medicine. I'm the analyst on ClinGen. I'm Carolyn Hutter. I'm also a program director in the Division of Genomic Medicine at NHGRI, and I work primarily on the Cancer Genome Atlas and the Clinical Sequencing Exploratory Research Programs, as well as a little bit on ClinGen and some other, oh, and the Large Scale Sequencing Program and some other things. I'm Jeff Schloss, the director of Division of Genome Sciences at NHGRI. I'm Mike Pazin. I'm a program director in Division of Genome Sciences at Genome. I'm Tina Erf from NICHD. I'm a program director along with Anastasia Wise on the Insight program. Hi, I'm Evan Madden. I'm an epidemiologist at the Division of Genomic Medicine and um, one of the program directors for Ignite. I'm Heather Junkins. I'm a program director in the Division of Genomic Medicine. I work on the Ignite program and the training and career programs. 
Lucia Hendorf, Division of Genomic Medicine Program Director. I work on the CSER project, the population architecture using genomic and epidemiology or page program on the GWAS catalog. I'm Ken Wiley, Program Director, Division of Genomic Medicine, NHGRI. Oh, I want to, do we miss anyone? Oh, well, the, the metro just dropped off a new slide. <laughs> 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 Let them sit down. So I want to uh, thank all of you for making time. I know that some of you are on this coast uh, for today and then zipping back to watch your daughter graduate or other things like that. And many of you have crossed ponds and uh, big and small. So thank you all for your effort and, and, and uh, for everything you've brought. Um, maybe the, the three folks uh, along here, since you've you know, sat down for almost 10 seconds, could introduce yourself before Eric makes some comments. Hi, I'm Sherry Shelley, currently at the NCI, moving soon to the NIH OD. I'm Santa Timinia, and I'm from the National Eye Institute. Elise Feingold, NHGRI. <laughs> 